Well, as we wandered along the canal bank, this is one of the things you'll find every so often. It's a canal lock. And what's it for? Well, as you can imagine, the land is not level, so they have to keep the water level. And this is how they do it. What they do is this. They close the gates at the end, they fill this lock up, the boat will come in from this end here, then they let the water level back down by opening those gates, and the boat goes out, and of course, vice versa. And you know, these things have been used for, oh, several hundred years now, and they still haven't found a better way of doing it. Anyway, that's enough about uh, me telling you. Let's get Paddy, the local lock keeper here, to give you a little bit of a demonstration. And so maybe I'll give him a hand, you know. Good, but well, look, well, this is working beautifully. You know, I think I'm going to have to ask for Paddy's help on this one. It's really open. The boat can go out and right down the canal until it meets the next one of these. The painting of it that you get back to yours. Now you got the idea, haven't you? Yes, the lock gate. <laughs> and did you see how good I was at it? Yes, I'd make an excellent lock gate person. To wind that thing, you'd want to be a horse. Well, of course, there were horses. Now, put out some burnt umber, some lemon yellow. I'll put the lemon yellow over here beside the blue because we're going to need that. And I'm going to put out some of the... Where's our nice red? There, a little bit of cadmium red. Let's put a bit of that out. You'll see why in a minute. Okay, let's go. We're going to put some trees in. Now, first of all, I'm going to take some of this cadmium red and just at the back of the... Oh, that's pretty mean looking. I'll take a bit of yellow with it. Look, just at the back of the where the gates are and just covering them that way with some nice pinky colour. Then I'm going to go into me blue and me yellow. Yeah, what is that going to give me? Blue and yellow? It's going to give me green, isn't it? Yes, look. I just want to create a nice effect there. This, even though it wasn't the best of a day, so what's that got to do with it? We can, the brush is mightier than the weather, than the, it's mightier than a bulldozer, I always say. Because you can, of course, change the color. Now I'm just going to leave that for a minute to dry and then I'm going over the other side of this thing here because uh, it's a good idea. Yeah, so you just, see what I'm doing? Just creating a little bit of depth there. Started out, just put a little bit of the old uh, cadmium red on. Now I'm just going to mix up some darker green. This is more yellow and blue, but leaning heavily. You got it. Make the trees on both sides exactly the same height. You know what I mean by that? If they're that height there, don't make them the same over the far side. There's a great little story to be told, and this is true, like all Irish tales, yes. There's a story of a guy in the old